Hey guys, in today's video, we're just going to be playing the new Torrential Waves mode. This is a wave-based game mode, obviously, and there are 24 waves in total. The goal is to get as far as you can and claim the maximum amount of rewards. The mode itself isn't necessarily hard and the reward is decent. The only issue you might face is just staying awake. This mode could have been a lot of fun, but the lack of co-op and its slow pacing just kill whatever momentum it could have had. If I could have hop on here with a friend, or even just meet up with random players via matchmaking, this could have been a blast. I'm not implying it should have been exclusively multiplayer. Solo players and people who want to play solo should 100% have the option to do so. Even if I claimed my reward from it for the week, I would have still hop on and see if I could help lower level players and just have fun. This is just my opinion. But after my first clear, I had no interest in coming back to this game mode. All they had to do, in my opinion, is add multiplayer, beef up the enemies, and speed up the time delays that are in between rounds, and this could have been a banger. With all the games screaming for our attention these days, gameplay choices like this just isn't going to keep anyone's attention for long. Imagine if you're someone who is spending money on these characters and skins. Don't you want people to see your characters in action? If all these events are just single-player experiences, then what's our motivation to spend? Would you buy an expensive suit or dress just to have it collect dust in your closet? Let me ask you something. How do you feel about Maxor's new outfit? Do you like it? Do you like her new hairstyle? Her new hair ornaments? Her nails? Let's assume for a moment Maxor was a real girl. Do you think she would have dolled up herself this much just to be cooped up in a house? Of course not. She wants to be seen, and that's why we need more multiplayer experiences. At the moment, Snowbreak feels like something that exists in a bubble. Nothing you do in it matters to anyone except yourself. Although not everyone wants to be social all the time, when your end goal is the monetization of cosmetics, having an audience for your customers to show off their purchases to can result in more sales. That was a very poor metaphor, but the point is just add more multiplayer, please. Single-player experiences usually have a strong narrative to carry them. I'm not implying snow breaks. Narrative is weak. It's just not strong enough to carry this player base. Just look at the Twitch community. Hardly anyone is watching. Snow break on Twitch. It's not because the game isn't fun. It's because the game is not engaging. With the right difficulty, rewards, and multiplayer, many players who are unable to clear a mode like this would have seek out help from others in the community. Driving up YouTube and Twitch viewerships and player engagement overall. Just imagine being a Twitch streamer. You have drops enabled for snow breaks and people are showing up to your stream saying, hey dude, I'm having a hard time completing Torrential Waves 24. Could I get a carry? And you'd have to put the poor bastard on a queue because there are 10 other people in front of him. With a single player experience, you don't have that level of engagement without a strong narrative or some kind of wow factor which snow break does not have. Anyway, I haven't been posting much Snowbreak content because I feel like there is nothing to post. After my initial character summon and guide, I don't really see anything that would be worth the time investment for myself and my viewers. This is an issue that can be fixed if they focus more on the social aspect of things and not single player experiences. Well, that's all I have for you guys. I won't make this too long. I'll likely just skip a couple waves to keep this as short as possible. What do you guys think about Snowbreak so far? I know the content we're getting now is backlog, but I really hope this will not be where we still are a year from now.